hello hello crafty peeps welcome back to my channel crafty ish Kristen. today we are going to be doing a post review and kit down on boo sheet this is my first canvas from raven diamond art it was a i think it was 30 by 40 do i oh i have a tape measure hang on do, do, do. i believe it was 30 yes 40 and yes 30 all right 30 by 40 round drills 37 colors and it was a very quick little fun project um oh hello um somebody needs attention clearly um you're distracting me i was in the middle of saying something really amazing and profound and now i've lost it thanks a lot So, uh, I, somebody did recommend that I try to put this under a black light. Uh, unfortunately I cannot find a black light in my house. Uh, so I'm not sure if it glows or not, but that would be really cool if it does. Again, I don't know because we had a black light, uh, but it got put somewhere. I did not run out of any colors. Uh, this was my trash, not a ton. Wait, yeah, that's the trash. Yep. Not a ton of trash and mainly the trashy bits were circles that weren't quite, um, uh, formed, if that makes sense. Uh, I am not the best at figuring out if a, if a drill will will look right on a round canvas until I put it down. Uh, so there's probably, I mean, yeah, there's probably some not too big ones and I did not go through and straighten my drills. So there are some areas that are a little crooked and I also haven't rollered it. Uh, but like over here, uh, yeah, that's all operator error being impatient with the multi-placing. Uh, I'm not the best multi-placing at round drills either. I You got to get that drill stretch, if you know what I mean, where it, you know, actually gets on them. Uh, so yeah, I could have been a little more meticulous with my placement, uh, but I was doing it for enjoyment. So yay all around. And like I said, I did not run out of any colors and there was no color that was more trashy than the rest i mean technically i have more pink but that was because there's a lot more pink in this kit than anything else so i'm going to put these in my round drill storage containers and then i actually have some <laughs> some spare round drills go figure right uh, see, I don't think I need anything out of my Care Bear lunchbox. I have a tray. I have my amazing ruler from, let's see. Nope. Just want to make sure. This is from Sharon. She sent me this. I do need to reinforce it so I don't break it like I broke the other one. But that is a later, that is a later issue, not a right now issue. Okay, that's, that's box number two. I only have two boxes for my round drills uh excuse you you are going to get banned all right put the drills over here and if it's shadowy i apologize but i am recording later than normal that is my tray oh, it's gonna be one of those and so i have my overhead lights i have my side lights on uh it's kind of raining outside which is you know good we need rain obviously uh, but it's making it very dark all right so the one thing i don't like about these containers is that the lids don't stay on super well and i'm always concerned when i take them in and out of their you know this thingy that i'm going to weaken it and it's going to make them even looser because I mean, they, they come out really easy and I will take stickers off later. I am not doing that right now, 
I just changed my nails, so we're not doing that. No, thank you, Duncan. You're just going to fall asleep on the table? I caught him right before I started getting this stuff out. He was sitting on his little perch over by the window, and he was sleeping with his face just shoved down into the into the blanket. It was almost like he had himself in a little mini timeout. So cute. Not that I want my cat to be in timeout, but you know what I mean. Okay, 300 was behind 301. And uh, yeah, as you can see, there's there's lots of room here in the in the round grills. I was gonna look I was gonna look this up and I forgot. Oh, I just didn't see and I didn't use my ruler. Uh, how many the round to square drill kit ratios. I know I've done I know I've done more squares, obviously. I wasn't sure how many, many more, you know? So I actually have these drink cups in the back to kind of hold it. So they kind of keep their shape. Oh, that's one thing. These don't pour nicely when you're trying to go into a small area. That's okay. I hope everybody is doing well. I hope you're doing something fun and not something boring. But if you are doing something boring, uh, I hope you're done with it quickly. Three, three, three. Oh, would you oh, look at I have. Oh, wow, those are so different. I can't see it very well, but this one is a lot lighter. It's okay. I don't separate them by color like this because you know you never know which shade is going to be the one that you actually need for a project if you're trying to color match 370 370 and I also don't separate round and I mean, not round. Well, yes, I do separate round and square drills because that would be that would be tricky. Uh, I don't separate the acrylic and resin round drills because that's I don't do enough of either one of them to really warrant separating them. Goodbye, Duncan. It was nice seeing you again. Uh, but I also, I'm, oh, geez, look at that. All those, okay. Where? 6, 10, okay. Let's, oh my gosh. What is going on? Look at that, making a mess. Okay. Ugh. My gosh, there. Okay, this one needs another cup. I guess. Just make it a little bit tighter in there. Things are just flopping around. We don't want that. Uh, yes, I don't I don't separate the round resin acrylic. Because, yeah. I don't need these box to be even thicker than they already are. I only have two boxes for rounds. And as you can see, there's a lot of extra room. And I'm okay with that. Because the squares are right now in seven boxes, which is a smidge bit ridiculous, in my opinion. Five, five, two. Alright, we got some very pretty colors in this kit. Very, very, very. I was going to wait and save this kit for Christmas time. I'm not Christmas. Shh. Halloween. I mean, Halloween is some of your guys's Christmases, right? <laughs> but I was going to save it. But then I thought, well, no, because I'm doing a lot of square kits, a lot of big kits. So, and I wanted to try out 
Raven since I have never had one of their kits. And, you know, if I see something else that I want, I wanted to make sure that I had tried out their kits because if I didn't like them, then, you know, you don't want to spend money on something that you don't like. But it was very enjoyable. And I don't do a ton of rounds. It made me not, it didn't make me hate rounds. So that's always a good thing. Well, let's see, go in there. Oh my gosh, my, my sleeve is wet. <laughs> I can feel it and it's kind of gross feeling, but I forgot to change my sweatshirt. Now I'm already you know, deep in the thick of things. Oh yeah, see those are two different colors. It's fine. It's fine. Look away if it bothers you. Okay, that was seven. Oh, 720. And that's 720. So I did get a new Raven kit, the last launch date. And it's a, it's like a Halloween cat. And it's, I don't know if it's by the same artist or not. I didn't look. I was going to, and then I forgot. But it's very kind of like purples and stuff like that. Well, it's not bloody, gory Halloween. It's still kind of cute, but the cat does look a little murdery. He probably is hungry wants his dinner. Or maybe he wants some, you know, Halloween candy. I was actually surprised that I, that I got the kit because they, you know, they do a every two week release and it releases it. I don't know. It's it's 8 a.m. Pacific time. I don't know. I think it's supposed to be 10 Central or Eastern. I don't. Time zones, man. I, I don't understand them. So I actually set my alarm to make sure that I was awake and remembered to, to do it. Okay, why is there no 799? Ugh. Why is there... Hmm. Uh oh. That's seven nine eight. Uh oh. I feel it in there. Okay. There's no seven nine seven. There's no. Ugh, don't be messing with me. I don't need to be messed with. Okay. Let's let's see seven nine eight. 800. Why is there no 799? <gasps> oh, I, th I think I actually have some of these colors in a bag because I have the kits from Meow and Forever. And I think I pulled out all the bags. Do I know where those are? Not fully. That's... Hang on. Hold, please. Is that what this is right here? <gasps> I think it is. I think it is. Did I just find a bag of forbidden things? I may have. Okay, yeah, I bet it's in this. Oh, why do I make things more difficult for myself? That reminds me, I still need to finish those. They got put on a shelf, and then, you know, how you don't see it, and so then you don't think about it. Yeah. Seven, okay, seven, nine, get off my arm. Seven, nine, seven, nine, four... 
nine, seven. Oh, okay, there we go. Well, I will put them back in there just so I know that that's where that came from. Yep. Okay, put that there. At least I'm not going crazy. Not right now, anyways. 820. There's that. I swear, summertime is the hardest when you have kids because, you know, I would love to stick to a, a schedule, you know, where everybody goes to bed at the same time and not staying up all late playing video games and making noises and whatevers, but uh, yeah, no, I am the only one in the family who wants to do that. It would be fine if when people stay up, if they were actually quiet, but they're not. <laughs> not at all. 9.15. What is in here? Oh, this is bags of, oh, like special drills and stuff. That's a whole nother, that's a whole nother video. I don't got time to deal with that right now. Okay, we had 9.15, uh, but fortunately my son likes to play online games, like virtual reality, you know, type games where everybody's playing together, and so everybody's, you know, screaming and yelling and stomping, so can't really go to sleep with that noise going on. Uh, and my daughter, she, she, she could probably be quiet because she just wants to watch videos and, you know, play games that don't involve screaming and yelling. <laughs> and then my husband gets off work at 10, so he gets home at 10.30, and then he stays up and watches things on his iPad, and he calls it his, uh, his couch nap because he comes home and then he goes downstairs and talks with my mom and watches the news and for a little bit and then he'll come upstairs and he'll lay on the couch and he'll watch some stuff on his iPad and he'll fall asleep and then he'll wake up like an hour later and <laughs> then go to bed <laughs> uh, and since I am a very light sleeper any kind of noises or movement or anything it makes me wake up uh, so I don't really get to go to sleep until everyone else is done doing their their futzing and their plutzing and all that stuff Ugh. I wish I could but I have never been a a good sleeper even as a kid I would lay there for hours just kind of rolling around and that was probably due to diet because I would drink pretty much only soda and eat a lot of sugar I mean so that you know that could have been why as a child but I don't drink caffeine past you know 3 p.m. now and I try not to eat a bunch of crap right before bed uh, but it doesn't seem to matter I've tried meditating I've tried the essential oils and you know not watching anything on a screen try to read something boring just nothing i've even done like medication you know i've tried the melatonin i've tried the like magnesium type things i've actually had prescriptions where you know like have like a not like i've never done ambien uh, but i've done similar drug you know well no i'm not trying to say i've been doing drugs but i've tried it very oh don't be doing that various prescriptions that you know are supposed to help that yeah didn't help that is the one thing about this system when the drills are not full they they slip and they go under each other very very easily I just, I don't sleep all night. I have a hard time. Oh, those are so different. It's fine. So I've accepted it. It is what it is. 3705. 
three. Okay, don't. Don't. Stop. Too floppy. Like right now, I don't have a Dr. Pepper, even though I would really, really like a Dr. Pepper right now. But it is too late. 3688. Eight. Well, that's not the right color. Um, this one might be in here. Let's go back. What number? 3705. 3705. 3705. We are in the four digit numbers. We have 3609. 3705. Look at that. I'm so glad I remembered that. I would have been sitting here wondering if I'm lost my dang mind. Not this time. There's that. There's that. 3731. 3721. Not that 31. That's a totally different color. Okay. That one is, are you in there? 3721. And I actually, <laughs> I really appreciated the fact that they put this, the symbols in order by number first then alphabet and they didn't you know they skipped some letters but then they didn't insert a symbol where that letter should have been uh, so i pretty much put the stickers on and i didn't have to rearrange the symbols uh, i don't know if i've ever had a kit where i didn't have to do that now there are some symbols on here um, but there were only six uh, symbols that weren't a letter or a number. Uh, usually I would rearrange the symbols so they, they made sense in my brain. But because it was such a small kit, I figured that I could probably just leave them where they were. And if I really got confused, I could rearrange them, but I didn't. So I left them in DMC number order the entire time. Fantastic. Okay, 3781. 3781. 3781. There's that. I'm not even using a tray there, just in case. I'm just so confident of myself and that I'm not going to spill all over. Three eight. Whoa. Jeez. Three eight oh five. Yeah, there was only one color in this kit that had multiple bottles. And that was uh that was this one. Number D six oh two. There were two and a half containers. 3819. There's that. There's that. Look at that. Oof. So much faster than kidding up. I always think it's going to take forever, and it doesn't. And there was no static with these drills either. But that was also probably because, you know, it's they're acrylic drills. And I don't know if acrylics get static. If they do, they're not as aggressively annoying as the resin drills and their perma static, seemingly. Come on, open up. You want to go in there. I know you do. There's that, there's that, there's that. Put the lid on. Oh, no, don't come over here. Just because you heard plastic doesn't mean you need to come over here. So that is that. I will dump these into my trash drill bottle and I will scrape the stickers off 
after the fact. Oopsie. And that is that. If you guys have not joined my Facebook group, the link is listed in the description box below, along with the information on my storage boxes and, you know, like what I did and like link to the bags and, and all the jazz. Um, and if you have any questions, go ahead and leave a comment and yeah, that is all I can think of right now. So until next time, big awkward hugs. Bye guys. <laughs>